I'm finished speaking to both of you, okay? You're both fucking insane. You want to know what your problem is? MTV, Playboy, and Madison fucking Avenue. Yes, let me explain something to you, okay? Girls with big tits have big asses. Girls with little tits have little asses. That's the way it goes. God doesn't fuck around. He's a fair guy. He gave the fatties big, beautiful tits. And the skinnies, little, tiny nibblers. It's not my rule. You don't like it, call him. Hey, Mitch. Thank you. Oh, guys, look what we have here. Look at this. Your favorite. Oh, you like that? I'd go along with that. Yeah, that's nice, right? Well, it doesn't exist, okay? Look at the hair. The hair is long, is flowing, it's like a river. Well, it's a fucking weave, okay? No. And the tits. Please, I could hang my overcoat on them. Tits by design were invented to be suckled by babies. Yes, they're purely functional. These are Silicon City. And look, my favorite, the shaved pubis. Pubic hair being so unruly and all. Very key. This is a mockery. This is a sham. This is bullshit. <coughs> Implants, collagen, plastic, cap teeth, the fat sucked out, the hair extended, the nose fixed, the bush shape. These are not real women, all right? They're beauty freaks. And they make all us normal women with our wrinkles, our puckered boobs, hi, Bob, our cellulite, feel somehow inadequate. Well, I don't buy it, all right? But you fucking mooks, you think if there's a chance in hell that you'll end up with one of these women, you don't give us real women anything approaching a commitment. It's pathetic. I don't know what you think you're going to do. You're going to end up 80 years old drooling in some nursing home. Then you're going to decide it's time to settle down, get married, have kids. What are you going to find a cheerleader? Charge it, Mitch. I think you're oversimplifying. Oh, eat me. Look at Paul with his models on the wall, his dog named Elle McPherson. He's insane. He's obsessed. You're all obsessed. If you had an ounce of self-esteem, of self-worth, of self-confidence, you would realize that as trite as it may sound, beauty is truly skin deep. And you know what? If you ever did hook one of those girls, I guarantee you'd be sick of her. Yeah, I suppose I'd get sick of her after about, what, 20 or 30 years? Hmm. Get over yourself. Thank you, Mitch. What? Say hello to Gertrude. No matter how perfect the nipple, how supple the thigh, unless there's some other shit going on in the relationship besides the physical, it's gonna get old, okay? And you guys, as a gender, have got to get a grip. Otherwise, the future of the human race is in jeopardy. What was that? I have to wait for you, Pete? I don't know. You could slow down. Great ass. Nice tits. Come on, let's go.